Hey, Virgo, Sun, and Rising in Venus. This is what we got going on for October 27, 2022. If you'd like to make a purchase, you can go ahead and do so at tarotbarbie.com. I got crystal sage incense, personal readings, and much more. Let's get a Virgo's coming with the Five of Swords, the Fool card, and the Nine of Swords. So it looks like a lot of people are pretty pissed off for whoever this person is uh, running the spiritual community. Here is how I'm seeing it, Virgos. They are obsessed. They are, wow, okay. So they are obsessed, Virgos. This person's definitely obsessed with trying to hurt you and harm you. Um, but nonetheless, it looks like it could be a spiritual community that's coming in for a lot of you guys. Uh, however, though, they're not going to get, they, they're calling this person a dishonor. They are a dishonor to the spiritual realm with the five of swords in reverse. They have committed a lot of crimes here as well on innocent people, on light workers, on earth angels, and they're going to be eventually blocked. They are blocked already at the moment. They're blocked in all areas of their life. They're pissed, they're malice, they're mean, they're evil as hell as well, and they cannot, they don't have control of their mouth. Maybe this person's cussing a lot of people out. Maybe they're running their mouths, talking a lot of shit as well, but they are the things that they're saying about you is pretty bad Virgos uh, that will of fortune is coming in but more so with the fact that they are going to be who maybe this person's getting cursed Virgos somebody here is getting cursed from divination they are getting cursed because in all four corners around this wheel of fortune they are being judged every debt that they have caused under <sighs> every debt that they have done that was a bad deed is getting written down is being judged is being written and is being notified yes this person is considered a snake and the spirits and the and the guys they don't like this at all so the spirit guys don't like this type of stuff this type of stuff the angels don't like it it's being judged they're pulling up the sword it's it's time for it goes for this person to the, this person went through a huge test and they failed their test they failed their test they have no more happiness coming into their life they're negative they're pessimistic and maybe more so going through with some sort of depression now because they they're not getting what they want because of their evil and immature actions with that page of wands in reverse this person will no longer be able to move forward i'm getting an aries leo a gemini libra aquarius this person is not going to be able to move forward at all ten of swords in reverse they thought that they were going to win from this situation but they're not this is a completed cycle that they've done and that they harmed themselves in they legit destroyed themselves they hurt themselves i heard that this person is going absolutely insane they're losing their mind they cannot believe what they have put themselves into this person uses like a disguise on them they, they like they disguise themselves they pretend to be like this uh they they pretend to be like this uh they are the king of swords in reverse. So this person cusses everybody out and yells at a lot of people, but they act like they would never do this type of stuff to innocent people, but they do. They hurt people. This person here, masculine energy for sure, is losing their mind for what they've done to do for what they've done to you. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Scorpio energy here too. Uh, they think that they're going to be able to get out of that ten of swords in reverse, but it's not. They're trying their hardest to get out of the, out of all the bullshit that they cause on themselves. They cannot, they're, they're actually all good. They're going to fall from above him and they're also going to fall from under him at the same time. You see how he's on his face there? They're all going to fall on top of him. If they're falling on top, they're falling on the bottom. So this person is um, filled with burden, stress, disaster, calamity. It's all hitting this person all at one time. It is a very much so a struggle that this person cannot keep up. They are... That's crazy, Virgos. Eight of Swords, they are losing their mind. They're not able to move forward. They did get caught. They are a fool for what they've done. They are foolish. The foolish things that they have done that they should never have done to you, they did it anyway, and that's exactly why they're losing their mind. They have nobody else to blame except themselves. Eight of Swords, this person is stressed as fuck. We go from the eight to the nine. I'm telling you, Virgos, this, these people are losing their fucking minds. They're losing their minds. All the people that sat here uh, in the spiritual community fucking doing you, one hurting you, harming you, wanting to wish fucking... The, the big D on you, the fucking wishing you the worst, trying to do everything they can to friggin' wipe you the fuck out, to, to destroy you, to hurt you, is exactly what's happening to them now. They're losing their fucking mind. They're going to end up in a either loony bin or they're going to end up somewhere where they don't, where they're not going to, where they never thought they would end up actually. Uh, Nine of Swords, they are still losing their mind. They cannot sleep. They are stressed over the fact that they spent so much money. Somebody here has sent out a ton of money, ten of, Ace of 
That's crazy. Ace of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles, none of the work that they did, none of the money that they used to spend to fuck you up work, but in fact, it brought in the death to them. So now they are stressed out and they are losing their money and they are blocked in all areas of their life. Four of Wands, they are no longer happy. No, they are no longer celebrating. They're trying to find a way to get out of the situation, but they know that they dug themselves a big, huge hole that they're not going to be able to. They are sad, they are regretful, and they are trying to remove themselves from this situation, but they cannot. If they're trying to find a way to get themselves out of it with the Eight of Pentacles or the Seven of Cups, it's saying, no, you cannot. This person talks a lot of shit about shit that they don't know nothing about you. They only see you, they only see what you can, what you bring to the table, but they cannot see anything further than that. Meaning, the other thing that they're talking about you has literally, you're not allowed to backbite. That's just the straight up truth. You're not allowed to backbite. You're not allowed to talk shit on people's name. That's a fucking debt in your name. And it's been so debted in your name that you literally have cursed yourself from, this, from the universe. That's fucking crazy. Five of Wands in reverse you're not trying to look for beef Virgos but this person is no longer going to be able to keep up this fight it's been going on for too long they're running out of money they spent a weight they spent more money that they ever anticipated to spend on you they don't realize who you are what you are what you're capable of they came up against somebody that they should never have even tried and this is the consequences of their actions they will no longer be able to move forward the they are disconnected Virgos they cannot move forward anymore they are stuck spiritually from being able to get even close to you Queen of Cups star card because you are the star because you are the queen and you guys really put these people in check to let them know hey as a as kind and as loving as I am, I'm not, I will always be kind and loving that you are. You will continue to be that way, but do not mess with me at the same time. Queen of Cups, Cancer Pisces, Scorpio, all right? Uh, but you guys got that stuff, whatever, in your chart. So this is definitely a spiritual community who work on the darker side, all right? But they're coming to the realization and learning that your strength and your power you're not you're not to be reckoned with you're not to be reckoned with. do not mess with this empress do not mess with somebody who is divinely protected do not mess with a chosen one do not mess with somebody who will put you in your place automatically without you having to do anything at all this one here is like you do anything bad you look at them bad you talk bad to them you disrespect them you say anything bad about them it's coming back for you full 100 coming back for you one this this empress don't have to really do a whole lot to you in order for you to understand her strength and her power you're way more powerful than you ever probably perceived yourselves to be Virgos, but they're seeing you for who you are now. Two of Wands, Knight of Pentacles, and the Eight of Cups. Eclipse Energy Virgos, this, per this person is going to be having to leave behind the shit that they have done to you and move on with their life. They, it's it's enough now. They've been going at you for a good eight months, eight, nine, ten, ten months. Since last year, August, they've been going at you. So just over a, a year and a couple of months, a year and two months, they've been coming after you pretty hard. Uh, they're, they, they're, they want to get out there. So, so they're pretty much annoyed. They're agitated. They're frustrated. They're upset with the page of cups. They're sitting there talking shit, hoping that they can make offers, but they will not no longer be able to move forward. Six of swords in reverse. This emperor is very fucking angry and pissed off because the decisions that they made are the reason why they are in the predicament that they are. They have to pay up for the consequences of their actions because this is a very narcissistic. This is somebody who has no control, no power, no protection. They the spirit with the six of swords in reverse you do not have the right of passageway you do not have that you do not have the right of passageway where it would be the right of passageway for somebody else. You do not have that credit for you to be able to move forward in that type of direction. Spiritually speaking, you are not in any category or in your DNA to be moving in a position to have the right of passageway. Do you understand how powerful that is? You do not have the you do not have the power. You do not have the DNA for you to be moving in a direction where you have the right of passageway because you don't work from a good place in your heart because you're not you're not spiritually connected to divination you are not chosen you are a narcissistic crazy ass motherfucker who sits there and hurts harms uh, innocent souls and divinated people who do you think you are emperor in reverse you really need do you really need me to tell you that spiritually no one's coming to fucking help you out six of swords that you don't have the right of passageway that no one's coming to save you for all the crap that you've done that when you're left alone you're really gonna feel that you are actually left alone emperor in reverse aries taurus libra aries has been coming into your energy virgos quite a bit lately and they have been they have been and they've been coming in for a while too not just like recently but they have been all right they they're they're 
Their quick decisions is the reason why they will no longer be able to move forward. Spirit wants nothing to do with them. They don't want nothing to do with their offers. Even if they go and they try and make offers, pun offers, pun offers to the spiritual realm, spirit is not accepting it. They don't want it. Six of swords in reverse. They don't fucking want it. They don't want it, Virgos. This person wanted to have the six of wands. They wanted to win at all costs. They wanted to win. But in turn, the you guys are going to be the one uh, being victorious out of the situation. Trials are going to overcome. Uh, and, the, and it's going to cause a lot of heartache on this person. Maybe their heart space is going to end up being hurt. Uh, it's judgment is in reverse. Mm -mm. Judgment is saying we are no longer letting this person come in and step in and hurt you anymore. We're not going to grant this anymore. Six of it's judgment in reverse. Uh, this person is jealous and works out of envious. They will no longer have money. Eight of wands in reverse. Things are not going to pick up for this person either. You guys will come out of the cold. They are still going to watch you. But they're not really going to be able to see everything about you, which is funny and crazy is that you guys look like you're giving this person the thumbs down. Thumbs down, Virgos, is what you guys are giving to this person because it's like you did all of this stuff. You screwed yourself up. You fucked your, your money. You let people see who you really are. You allowed people to sit here and judge you, right, Emperor? You let people, because you went and you recruited people. You recruit. You said, hey, can you please can you please do and fuck this one up? You let people see who you were. They, you let them see who you what your character is at the end of the day. When nobody's hurting you, but you getting a group of gang people, gang stalking people just to hurt them. So High Priestess, you're saying, thumbs down, you did a really bad job by going out of your way to do this much shit to somebody. Meanwhile, you don't, you don't know their position. You don't, you're not spiritually up there. It is what it is. And I'm, and I'm going to say it very loud and clear. You're not spiritually up there. You do not have the right of passage, weight emperor in reverse. You have no control. You have no power. And you are also not protected in any way, shape, and form. Because what you did was you let the universe, the angels, all, you let them curse you because that's a debt in your name now. You want to do wrong on prophets and prophecies and divination and earth angels and light workers and high priestesses when they're not hurting you because you're sitting there out of jealousy and hatred? King of Swords in Reverse, you're talking a lot of shit. And I can let you know that you are talking a lot of shit because you're the Page of Wands in Reverse, the King of Swords in Reverse, you're the Emperor in Reverse, you're the King of Swords in Reverse, you're the Hierophant in Reverse. You are all the way fucked up. And on top of that, you're losing your fucking mind. You're losing your mind. How did I spend all this fucking money and I didn't get what I wanted? How did I end up in the death energy? How did I end up... Did it, did it, like, the fuck you mean? You cannot, you cannot move forward. You're absolutely done and over with. Uh, High Priestess, you have showed your strength. You have showed your power. You have showed your confidence. You have showed your integrity, the balance, how grounded you are. And you can finally come out of this situation with the four of swords in reverse. This person has 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 really fucked you up like really had you in a position of like okay i have to show my high priestess energy i have to show my queen of wands energy i have to show this person that i am actually in fact the king of pentacles i am always going to be secured you are going to always be successful and rich and healthy and wealthy and bossed up at the end of the day that you are in fact connected to divination and this person really did a whole fucking lot of shit to you virgos trying to mess with you guys's uh gifts trying to mess with your M mess with your gifts, with, mess with your well-being, trying to fucking take you off pedestal, trying to keep you not grounded, doesn't want you to upload, doesn't want you to fucking do nothing, doesn't want you to uh, continue to move forward, doesn't want you to have anyone care about you, doesn't want anyone to support you. This person is so jealous of you guys, it's actually remarkable on how far they went just to fuck themselves up Virgos these people are realizing with the seven of Pentacles that they may have not should, should, should they're realizing that you, you are not you are not you are not to be reckoned with Virgos you are the Queen of Swords upright the King of Pentacles upright Queen of Wands upright the Empress upright the Queen of Cups upright these people had this person had gone to so many people to work against you they're saying here, Virgos, that it cannot be altered. What can't be altered? You, you cannot change someone's destiny. If these people try to change your destiny, try to change your fortune, it cannot be altered. What is written for you is already written for you. What's written for them is written for them. So it was already written in the books for them to do this stuff to you. So they didn't know that they were supposed to come into this earth plane to stop doing the shit that they're doing. So it cannot be altered. You cannot hinder and hurt anybody when it's already written. Your day was coming. You're supposed to learn from this with the, with the will of fortune. You, it was a test for you. And you failed your test. So for that, you get cursed. The spirits and the angels are cursing you. And if you think I'm wrong, go fucking read whatever you need to read to go educate yourself. I don't, don't comment in the comment section telling me, oh, Barbie, if you, 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 shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Shut up. Shut up. 
You 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 sitting here taking guidance and 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 stalking every single tarot reader on YouTube, and you want to sit here and talk shit in my comment section. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. Take the reading and keep going on with your with your business. None of my readings should be enough to piss you off at the end of the day. You don't like what you're hearing? Then click the fuck off. It is what it is. Queen of Swords. She does not play. She does not. She does not tolerate it. When once her sword is up. You better believe, you better believe shit's about to go the fuck down. Because when this Queen of Swords calls judgment, because that's what that is, it's judgment, okay? When the Queen of Swords sitting there calling judgment, everyone's coming for her, for her. Everyone's coming for her. You, this is how powerful she is. That whatever it is that she says, the angels, her ancestors, everyone is going to come through for her. Very powerful, very, very powerful. She's very, very respected in the spiritual realm. She is the magician. She is capable. She has power. And she brings in that tower energy to the Ten of Pentacles. You want to dis you want to you want to bring disharmony into my life? Let me show you what I'm capable of. You went up against somebody that you should never have gone up against. You should never have gotten. They got really powerful protectors, ancestors, and vengeance is being served at this point. Wrath is also being uh, served at this point, and also destruction, calamity, and depression is also coming in for this Aries. Uh, Taurus, Libra, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Leo energy, Scorpio energy as well. At the bottom of the deck, you got the seven of wands. You're very highly protected, Virgos. And justice is going to prevail in your favor. That justice, like your sword is up, uh, spirit sword is up. Meaning that when you call judgment, they're calling judgment too. Enough's enough. And judgment is being placed on these people that, hey, you know what? We are not going to take these three swords out of your back. We saw the unjust that you've done to people, that you weren't actually a very helping person. You were actually taken away from them. You didn't want them to be successful. You're trying to you're trying to blast their fucking prosperity. You didn't want nothing to be moving for them because of jealousy and envy. The eight of wands and the six of pentacles in reverse is all jealousy and envy. All of it is. And when you work out of a fucking crazy place like that, out of your heart space, out of low vibrational, toxic, fucked up energy, what makes you think that judgment's going to prevail and give you the opportunity to remove those, remove those swords from your heart space, Emperor, when you caused that much pain onto this Queen of Cups? What makes you think that you're going to have the privilege to have that removed from your heart space when you did that to this Queen of Cups? This Queen of Cups is not hurting you. So why should why why do you think for a second that you're going to have the privilege or that opportunity to be released from this pain, this mental anguish, losing your fucking mind when you when this when this queen of cups had to do everything they can to heal themselves and nobody fucking came for them. Not one person came for them. They had to take care of themselves and pray the fuck up. 7 of wands, justice card, right? And you guys are very highly protected, Virgos. A judgment is going to be placed for you guys that everything is going to work out for you, that justice will prevail for the fucking acts of spiritual crimes that this person has done onto you. You guys got very, very powerful angels that are working up uh, for you, Virgos, that are granting this to you. Uh, the angels, divination, love you very, very much. They say, do not forget that you have so much more happiness, so much more celebrations. These people really try to go out of, out of their way to get a bunch of other people to come and take away from you. They literally uh, joined a clique together so that way they can harm you and hurt you. But they are all losing their fucking minds, every fucking one of them. Every one of them is losing their minds. They, they, I don't think they've ever lost their mind to this extent before until they decide to cross you. They chose the right one when they decide to come after you now, eh? They, they chose the right one. Let them, let them, let them do what they want to do. This is the consequences of their shitty ass actions. They're going to be stuck in the past, Virgos. Uh, Spirit has seen how innocent and how loving you are with the Six of Cups. And they're going to continue to grant that they want you to be happy. They want you to celebrate. These people are nothing but low vibrational, narcissistic assholes. And they continue to make offers to the devil here. Their offerings are officially going to be now blocked. Somebody here is making an offering to this devil, but the offering will be blocked. Even the devil don't want to fuck with this person anymore. And they're going to have to go within to try and figure out what the fuck's going on. But Spirit is saying, no, it's time for you to just chill. Hang, man. It's, they, they can't, they're they stuck. They cannot go anywhere. Uh, Virgos, you guys have been in hermit, in hermit, just focusing on yourselves, minding your own business. And they put you through a lot of crap. Now they're sitting there watching you, wondering if they did you one. But realistically, you got your bounce back game is 100. You're very loving. You're very fair. You're very respected. And you guys are not hurting anybody with the King of Cups. When you guys are coming in as a King of Cups to the Nine of Pentacles, 
You're incredibly a very loving person. You guys have all this abundance coming towards you guys. And this is a cycle that you guys are about to complete with the world card. All your enemies are going to be exposed for who they are. They're not going to be able to run away from this, all right? The king of wands, they're still trying to act like they got control and power over this. Maybe they're going to want to try and bring an offering towards you with the two of cups. But you're like, fuck this and fuck you and fuck that three of wands. You move on with your life and you guys are absolutely good and great on your own. So they couldn't, so they couldn't destroy you. So now they want to come and join you. Fuck them, Virgos. Keep everybody where the fuck they belong. You had that opportunity to see who these people were. You had that opportunity to fucking see what their character was like. And this is the type of shit that they did onto you. Now you know who they are. Just like that saying goes, God hid you in plain sight. God hid you to, God hid you in plain sight. And they let you and they let you see who your enemies are and who the real ones are during the time that God was hiding you. Now you see who they are. And when they want to come and try and hope that they can bring some sort of friendship towards you in the future, because if they can't fucking destroy you, why don't, why can't they just fucking sit here and, and join you? No, no. When you were fucking around, you want to see how, how badly you can get fucked around with, right? All right now, King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Leo, Scorpio energy, Taurus energy here as well. This is crazy. These people need to be put in place, Virgos. At the end of the day, you are the queen of pentacles. You are grounded. You are fine. You are nurturing. You are loving. You are all earth. You are Gaia, they are saying. You are, you are mother earth. You are Gaia. Uh, and they want you to continue to remember who you are. Do not allow any of these people to try and come in and be your friend or anything like this because that's the last thing that they're ever going to be able to have. They had that opportunity to start that energy with you a long fucking time ago, but they chose to go up against you. And they've got they and they didn't stop. They kept going at you for a good a very long while at the end of the day. And because they did that, they have no place in your life. Continue to move forward, Virgos. You guys got so much more opportunities coming towards you. Three of Wands, Queen of Pentacles. Continue to stay grounded. You got more money coming towards you on the way. These people are not going to be able to hurt you or harm you or anything like that. If they ever try and act like, oh, they want to be your brethren or they want to be your friend or they want to be whatever the fuck what, the answer is always going to be a fucking finna no. They cannot. They cannot. Because God showed you who they were. They showed you who they were. And God did not let you, for you to become like them. You did not become like them. It's the King of Cups of the Nine of Cups. You did not become like this. You did not become like them. You stayed in you stayed in your own energy. You decide to say, you know what? I am spiritual. I know how spirituality works. I know how that negative shit fucking works. So you're not gonna do it. You stayed in your power, nine of cups. And you decide to say blessing pun blessing pun pun blessing. And you decide to say, you know what? The universe is gonna expose them. In all four corners, they will be exposed and they're not going to be able to run away. You guys are very divinely protected. You guys should always say your prayers, Virgos. Give thanks to the universe that no weapon formed against you will ever fucking prosper. These motherfuckers are sitting here losing their fucking mind for going up against you, for spending all that damn money on you. And still, they lost. Thanks, cuties. Bye.